Good morning there, Fox family. I hope everybody is just doing amazing. It's the beginning of a wonderful weekend. We send nothing but blessings to y'all and your family. I'm Dusty, this is Fox Holler Homestead, and as you can see, I'm actually not on the homestead right now, but I am working. I did make a post not too long ago about how I would be up at uh, Generation Facility, um, basically a refinery, right next to the re refinery, and um, what we are going to be doing is uh, um, working with uh, some contractors to do some repairs and replacements, but uh, I just figured I would show you guys a few things about uh, the crane that I'm on. I'm gonna check it out. Okay, so I don't have all my editing stuff or my computer, but uh, this is gonna be pretty awesome. So, as you can see, there's the crane. It is a 350 ton AT Grove and uh, show you some cool stuff about it. Um, as you can see, the boom is not all the way out. There's only two sections out. It still has three more. Now, the reason why they call it a 350 ton is not because it weighs 350 ton, but this is the maximum capacity, the maximum lifting capacity, which is 350 tons. Now, in consideration to the length of the crane, now, Granted, uh, this crane is so large that when uh, when the boom is down or when we're traveling down the road, AT actually stands for all terrain. Um, when the boom is down, hangs out over the rear of the crane and there's a dolly that the boom sits down on. Now, the length from the back of the crane right now to the front of the crane is 50 feet. Now, just to give you a sense of how big this thing is. Now, you guys saw the thumbnail and me standing up next to the tires, that's pretty pretty darn tall. You can see Brandon up there in uh, the tire comparison. Now in consideration to the outriggers, from that outrigger to this outrigger is about 29 feet. Same thing from this side over to the other side. The whole crane itself is about nine feet wide, the width, and uh, all that counterweight you can see up there. Now that is 220,000 pounds of counterweight 220,000 pounds of steel and as you can see again the full boom is not out this is something that uh, it does give it a little bit more capacity but uh, this is also something that uh, the lifting and the amount that it can lift is going to depend strongly on the configuration and the counterweight configuration etc etc so I'm not gonna go into a whole lot of that um, but uh, yeah here we are refinery good stuff but uh, again um, I know that this is not the homestead but this uh, my job like this is uh, it's something else that I really sincerely love and I love sharing it with you guys and I know that I didn't go over a whole lot of detail but I just wanted to throw out a video and let you guys all know I was thinking about you and I hope every one of you has an amazing weekend nothing but love and blessings to y'all and your families and uh, again I'm Dusty this is Fox Teller Homestead, and uh, yeah, you guys have an amazing weekend. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.